Deathclaw Girl here and welcome to another one of my videos. You can help support this channel by subscribing and liking and by grabbing some of my free ebooks and audiobooks. There's Vampress over there. Hi Vampress! Today I'm promoting Shades of Grey, an apocalyptic science fiction series, and Monster of Monsters, a sci-fi horror. You can read and or listen to the first two stories of both these series for free. I've left the link in the description. And now to this video. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the upcoming uh, rewards that we can get from the Spooky Scorch. There are some free ones, so let's go ahead and get to that. And I'm actually going to let Vampress take over since this is kind of her season. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Yes. Halloween's on mine. But anyway, yes, I'm going to let her take over. So that's it for me. So Vampress, go ahead and take over. So yes, yes, I am very excited about today because of the spooky scorch. So let's uh, go ahead and look at the possible prizes that you'll be grabbing from plans, uh, from the spooky bags. Uh, but before that, let me give a nice a shout out and thanks to uh, Sugar Bomb Rads for uh, posting these on Twitter. So now, now let's get to the list. And we will start with the good rewards and do a couple close-ups on uh, what you can be getting in apparel. Here's the Civil War era dress, the Civil War era suit, uh, the Ranger outfit and a hat they both clean, uh, and of course the uh, clean spacesuit helmet. I think all these were these are not new rewards, they're just rewards possible. And uh, next, uh, we'll be looking at the clown outfit, fireman, golf, and skeleton. Some up-close views of them. And uh, here we have the clown outfit. Uh, we'll also be taking a nice close look at the fireman and the golf uh, outfits. And uh, finally, we'll be taking a close look at the skeleton. Those were very nice uh, front and back views, so very, very well done on those. And now let's take an up close look at the next set of apparel. Here is the witch's outfit along with the witch's hat, uh, the pastor's vestments, and then we have the white springs jumpsuit, and finally the tattered mole head so yes it's uh, actually i believe you get a damage resistance with the tattered mole head might be one to check out uh one of the few headwears that does give you a slight uh, damage resistance i believe so now let's take a close look at some of the weapons and uh, next up we have some bladed weapons uh here is the sickle and next up, we have the meat hook. I, I, that one can actually be quite brutal, especially if you can get the third attachment. Here is the cultist blade. And finally, the cultist dagger. Very similar, just different appearances on that one. And now let's take a look at the next roll, which actually has some new items. First up are the Scarecrows. Those are actually very nice if you can grab them. And then we have the Pumpkin Grenade. I, I think it screams. I don't know if there's much damage. It does anything. If anyone can remember, please throw it in the comments. I don't remember exactly what this does. And our um, next item is a ghost skeleton costume, and it's a ghost one, so it's slightly different, but it sounds like you can only get it from the challenge event, so uh, be looking for that. And the other new thing is another challenge event reward. It is the Mothman Nestle. Yes, it's very cultist uh, reward, so let's now let's see what we have next. And now let's take a look at some of the rare rewards that are actually new. Uh, looks like they are about a 15% drop chance for the spooky back. So now let's take a close up look at each of them. It looks like they all will be honeycomb. And this is the paper jackal lantern. And then we have the honeycomb paper variant of the jackal lantern. And then we have the Honeycomb Paper Ghost Lantern. And finally, we have the Honeycomb Paper Ghost Lantern variant. 
Uh, now let's take a look at the next rule. We have a honeycomb, a paper, a spider, a lantern. Uh, that looks uh, very nice. And then we have the uh, rad skull rider helmet uh, to wear. Uh, the giant red dinosaur, which I think the other one was a fallout first only. So this maybe gives other people an opportunity to grab it. And this, of course, is a variant. And finally, we have the Wraith's Wrath, a paint for the assault rifle. Uh, now let's take a look, a close-up look at the next row. First up, we have a new skin for the chainsaw. It's not the chainsaw, just the skin for it. Ghostly grinder paint. And then we have the skeleton has finally uh, made his appearance, Mr. Bones. And then we have this mask, the executioner's mask and finally what everyone has been waiting for the princess backpack because who does not want to feel like a princess walking around the wasteland uh, and now let's continue on to the next row uh, this is some that has actually been looking forward to this gazelle bear and rooster gas mask aren't they just uh, adorable these are the ones I'm going to be really, really working my butt off to try to grab and snag from the spooky bags. Okay, let's move on. Then we have a variant of the Hellfire B2 prototype helmet paint, the torso, and uh, the rest of the body parts. We got the legs and the arms. So it looks like uh, you can grab the entire paint set, possibly if you luck out. Uh, now, these jack-o'-lantern suits aren't new, but they are still very cool to try to grab. Uh, now, let's move on to some of the pumpkins. We got some racks. Let's take a closer look at these rack groupings. So, you got the full pumpkin rack, the pumpkin rack. Uh, then we have the uh, half full and then half empty. And then we have individuals. So uh, I think that is uh, Jingles, if I remember right, and then a regular pumpkin. And then we have these two variants. And let's just keep going. And we still have a few more. Here's the mobster and the practice. Definitely go not so good at it. Here is surprised um, and the vault boy. And finally, not so great pictures of, but we got the vault door, vault tech, the green reaper cutout, and the pirate costume. I am so excited and very, very giddy, but I believe we have covered all the rewards. If you noticed anything that was not part of this video, definitely throw it in the comments for us. We would definitely like to go check it out and see if we can find more information on this new plan or item that is available as a reward from the spooky bags. Otherwise, uh, that is it for me. Uh, Vampress out. Always keep your thing sharp and of course, goodbye.